Well, hello, my friends. No, we are not in Night City. But it has a similar flair, doesn't it? A silver hand, in fact. But it's not Keanu Reeves. This is Ghost Runner 2. The demo, I should say. Now, this game is not a walking friendly game, but yet in the early stage, this tutorial slash demo area, we can take advantage of some of the quieter moments. Because if you're unfamiliar with this game, it's all about fast, precision, quick action. And it encourages you to get your, your speed running, training, I don't know what you want to call it. But the reason we're playing this game today is because we are so close to Cyberpunk 2.0 and they have introduced new ways to play in this update that releases on the 21st and part of their live stream they showed off these different builds one of them is called the Bullet Time Ninja which is very similar to Ghost Runner. Although, instead of bullet time, you are moving double time. It's all about speed in this one, like I said. But this new combat in Cyberpunk looks like they really changed up a few things and now it's very much a more versatile combat system at least by the looks of it and looks like it's going to be even more fun to fight out in the streets in Night City oh well I guess this is like a bullet time ninja now. So there we go. On a side note, what I like about this game so far is that it feels like it's a little bit more approachable. I played the first one and I got pretty far, but eventually it's so unforgiving and you really need to be precise and almost strategic about the way you go into it. And I'm sure this game will get crazy hard. Hey oh, but I'm actually interested because I didn't think I would be necessarily. Oh, critical. And at least the start points, checkpoints are pretty decent. Okay. Let's be a little bit faster and this is the way it should be. I think I could actually bounce those bullets back, but too late, he's dead. Yeah, so... Ironically, this game came out, the first one, a little around the same time as Cyberpunk. And now Ghost Runner 2 releases one month exactly from Cyberpunk Phantom Liberty. Oh, 
Ooh, an autumn sale. Let me know in the comments what you plan on buying. Uh, well, we could. Are you going to get Phantom Liberty? Apparently, I don't think it's coming out for PS4. My condolences. Oh, yeah. See, this is getting me in the mood for some bullet time ninja. These guys. Critical failure. Okay, so it saved that part. Huh. Oh, yeah, I need to swing my sword if I want to take him down. Okay, we are going way too fast. We are not thinking clearly. Let's just get it. See, this is where the fun comes. Oh my gosh. This is where the fun begins. What kind of Star Wars fan am I if I don't mention that? But yeah. It's learning the way in which to move around. Well, I got him too. All right. Swoot. I'm feeling ready for cyberpunk. <laughs> and that's not to discredit this game, Ghost Runner 505 Games. Uh, they have a pretty fun product. Like I said, I definitely can't beat that first one. Okay, now, if you've been following me, or if you haven't, I'll let you know. In Cyberpunk, I like to walk around like this. And again, this is not the type of game you really should do something like this. You want to be as quick as possible. Obviously, I've already played through this demo, and when I first saw those stairs, the parkour in me wanted to see, can I get to them? And, oh. <laughs> yeah, I kind of can. <laughs> it's just like Cyberpunk. But yeah, that said, there are reasons to explore this game, because there are little secrets to find. This isn't one of the secrets, but it looked cool when I said it, right? Oh, actually, I'm going to start this over, because, uh. Why not, right? See, in this part of the game, it tells you, oh, you need to dodge. And I just like that a lot. Maybe I might use it for a thumbnail, if that's all right. Let's take a photo right now. Oh, was that a cloud punk photo? Ooh, 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 probably won't get to that for a long time, but I also recommend cloud punk if you like cyberpunk. Now let's dodge this. Whoa. Alright, do a little wall running, a little sliding, a little opening of a door. Oh, here we go. Now, I pressed L1 at the appropriate time to get that finisher type of move. Tron. <laughs> it reminded me of Tron a little.
pretty self-explanatory, right? I mean, we all see it, right? We... Oh my gosh, we almost didn't make it. Oh, that was close. Oh, didn't get... There we go. Cyberpunk. It also gives me a bit of uh, the Ascent vibes. Another quality cyberpunk game I recommend if you like twin stick shooters that are pretty difficult, actually. Now let's go uh, surfing. I think they took this from Fortnite. <laughs> no, let's not be rude. Okay, here we go. Oh, critical failure. See, we see the combat starting to pick up a little bit. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Oh, you know what, though? Don't worry. I will become more powerful than you could possibly imagine. Back to what I was saying about exploring. This is the instance where this game encourages it, I believe. You see, we looked at this previous, right? Well... If we take it and go through here, and if we don't fall down, okay, so let's start that over. Would have been a lot cooler on the first try, but hey, try, try again. And, oh, look at that. Now we're on the other side. Well, I totally missed. So, that's a cool way. I don't know. I actually like coming from this way so far, but, oh, okay, I need to, okay, that was a close one, actually, did I get all of, oh, no, what a, what a lame way to go out there, come here. I did not do it in time. Okay. Alright, see? Remember, it's not very forgiving. You gotta... You gotta stay focused, young Padawan. Oh. Okay. Got him. Okay, earlier I thought... Yeah, that's what I thought I was gonna do. Oh! You need to pay attention to your environment, your ASMR friend. Okay. And this is where I get the sense that this is a little bit more approachable, because you get that block feature a lot faster in the game, and even though that wasn't a boss there, you know, a bigger guy that you have to move around, you know, I could still stay in combat while I was dodging, so that just feels a little more approachable than the first one. Okay, just trying to look at that billboard. Just like any other video game, there's little little collectibles you can find. Okay. Let's go. We're gonna keep this going. I think that uh, I'm getting more and more prepared 
for Cyberpunk 2.0. Oh, I should be a spokesman. The Temptus skill. You've gained access to a new skill. Tempest. 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 Using it creates an energy blast that pushes both your enemies and objects away. You can grapple yourself towards launched enemies. Press up on the D-pad to select Temptus, which was my nickname in college. <laughs> Use the force. <laughs> so yeah, you know, we push a thing, we run back, jump over, blue versus red, classic. Oh. And this is where we get our little Batman moment. Oh, except for he stepped right in front of me. This game will humble you quick. All right, let's try it again. No, no. All right, well, I was trying to hit that. Oh, what? No, it saved it. No. All right, well. If you want to go and blow that up, you got to go back. I can't do it. I got to keep moving forward. Wow, it's like I knew that that was there. So, always on the move. This game is very good at that. There we go. There we go. Come along with me, okay? Jump. Now, you don't want to do this on your speed run, okay? That's my PSA. But if you're looking for your collectibles, you know, you gotta stop and take a look around. If I could remember what that failure, Ferris Bueller, Ferris Bueller quote was, I would say it. Something about if you don't look around once in a while, you might miss it. Life moves by so fast, you might miss it. Now speaking of fast, this is where combat is starting to get interesting. played this a little before, so I, I don't even think I'm that good, but I am having a good run right now. No. See? As soon as I open my mouth. Yep. Did I get him? I don't know. Oh. Yep. No. See, you, you can't, there's very little room for error, error, I'm JFK, there is no room for error, you gotta be quick, precise, and everything nice, that's right, you gotta be a power book girl, oh, I almost jumped off the end, okay, oh, Oh, I could have done that move. Oh, well. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, uh, there must be a, a half-off sale. Cha-cha-cha, pa. <laughs> Terrible. Now. 
I don't know about you, but I think we're ready for Cyberpunk 2. Point. Oh. Let me know in the comments if you believe that. 2. Point. Whoa. 2. Point. Oh my. <laughs> now, another thing that excited me about the new stuff in Cyberpunk, one of the abilities showed leaping off of your motorcycle and I am super pumped about that for both combat and exploration options I'm excited to see how I can use that in Night City this is where the fun begins see got it right now oh I can start moving here we go I'm a bullet time ninja So I was digging the combat, thinking, yeah, okay, this feels pretty good, actually. And then you add this to it, and there's probably a small, and I mean small, portion of you, oh, didn't make it, that know of this game. Astral Chain, for the Nintendo Switch, has this similar type of vibe. Oh my god, that game, another sweet ass. <laughs> another sweet ass. That's it, just another sweet ass. Another sweet ass cyberpunk video. Okay, I need to go fast, right? Uh, but in that game, you, you don't do it as much as I would like, but you get that motorcycle action, kind of splits up the gameplay a bit, and yeah, I think that's a really cool addition. Here we go. Oh, I totally... Okay, alright. Oh, look at that. Dang, I kind of want to... <laughs> I wanted to see that cyberpunk stuff. Look at it. I know I'm going to lose the signal, I think. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, this is an alternative route. Doi. I don't have to go that other way. Oh, jeez. Okay. We got to catch up. Camp Mustard, we got to catch up. I'll be here all night. Okay. Faster and more intense. I didn't think I was going to make that. That was looking questionable. Here we go. Now, see, now, if someone better than I, who's, like, just crazy, like, all you street fighter button combo mashers, like, people that have good precision skills, playing this, Be a fun way to test out your precision skills. It's obviously like a meant to be speed ran. Well, it's meant to be enjoyed as well, I think. And you can enjoy it in many different ways. Oh, no, no, no. This reminds me of Return of the Jedi. Got a Split up positions. Oh, we're gonna run out of room real tight. Here we go. Oh, well, that's not gonna get me anywhere except for to critical failure. There we go. Oh, yeah. This just feels really good. Oh no. You gotta be faster. It's just like Star Wars where, you know, Obi-Wan and 
Qui-Gon had to wait before they could take on Darth Maul. Obi-Wan wasn't fast enough, just like I wasn't fast enough right there. Oh, I see Star Wars in so many things. It's ridiculous. Oh, oh, oh no. Okay, here we go. Gotta get this right. Oh, come on with this signal loss. Give me a break. Give me a break. Don't want to finish that because I'm not sponsored by that delicious cookie. It's not a cookie. Candy bar. And it's not all that delicious, but it's a candy bar. Okay, come on now. Okay, we're just gonna blaze through this thing. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. No. No, no, no. We were this close to greatness. Not a scratch, not a scratch. Oh, but man. See, this is where you gotta be quick. Yeah, oh my gosh. This is also the type of game that I would have a run, an amazing run, like a flawless type of run, but never in time to record it. <laughs> And that is why I'm playing Ghost Runner 2 to get prepared for Cyberpunk 2.0. But hey, this game is pretty fun. I am actually more interested in it than I thought. I liked the first one, like I said, but I didn't beat it. And I just thought, oh, this game gets really hard. But it's pretty fun. Maybe it's more approachable. And I might give it a shot. Well, goodbye for now. Next time I see you. I'll be in Night City.